Hello, this is Alexandra Miazzo. I am currently at LACMA. Um, you can see a um, critiquing Alberto Giacometti's painting here. So, this painting was around 1956. Between 1956 and 1961, Giacometti made over a dozen oil portraits and one sculpture of Japanese philosopher Isaku Nahara. Nahara interviewed Giacometti for a Japanese magazine in 1955, instigating a long friendship based on their shared interest in existentialist philosophy. The second in the group, this painting, features the seated figure suffused in this painting, features, oh, Glowing electric, sorry, electric light. It is less a physical portrait and more an apparition. As Giacometti said, I am not tempting likeness, but resemblance. So the portrait of Isaku Nahara by Alberto Giacometti is a really interesting and emotional painting. The figure Isaku Nahara sits in the middle of the canvas and everything around him looks rough, unfinished, and which gives the whole painting a raw feeling, like a lot of his work. Giacometti uses dark muted colors like gray, white, and black, and the figure looks stretched out and kind of fragile, which makes it feel sad and introspective. What stood out to me the most is how Giacometti's uh, brushstrokes seem messy and chaotic, Especially in the background, as you can see. Just very messy, kind of, you know, scribbles, kind of. Um, uh, where was I? Uh, but it still draws your attention to the person in the middle. The face is detailed, but not super clear. Almost like Giacometti was more focused on the mood and personality than the painting, than, than of um, personality of Inahara, than on making him look realistic as he, as it was mentioned here. Um, um, the rough texture adds this feeling. According to, to the foundation of Giacometti, Inohiro was a Japanese philosopher and a close friend as, uh, of Giacometti. He painted Inohiro several times exploring the complexity of human identity and presence through his portraits. The foundation describes these works as an intense exploration of individuality, highlighting Giacometti's unique approach to depicting his subjects. LACMA um, describes portrait of Isaku Yanahara as an example of Giacometti's post-war existentialism style. The painting is part of LACMA's collection and is noted for its rough texture, muted color palette, and the emotional intensity it conveys. LACMA um, emphasizes that sense of isolation and introspection in the painting which reflects Giacometti's philosophical outlook and artistic vision. Thank you very much, and this is my video. Not quite five minutes long, but right now I only have two citations, so thank you for watching.